The COVID-19 pandemic has taken over the headlines for the past couple of years. But with life returning to normal, other viruses are making a comeback. That is the case for Chesapeake Elementary School, which is dealing with norovirus. Ten in your sides, Kara Dixon has spent the day looking into it and what health experts are saying. Kara? Stephanie and Regina, Grassfield Elementary School was investigating a stomach illness and believes that it's norovirus, which is very, very contagious and makes those who have it extremely sick. The school and Chesapeake Health District are investigating what initiated the source of the infection and are working to prevent further spread. The school is open and operating as normal, according to the school district. I spoke with Dr. Laura Sass from CHKD. She says norovirus virus causes vomiting and diarrhea. It's known to happen on cruise ships or have outbreaks at large populated events making people sick. The good news though, it usually lasts about 24 to 48 hours. It spreads through vomit, contaminated water or contact with people's stool. Dr. Sass says to stop the spread, it's very important to not use alcohol hand based hand sanitizer, but to wash your hands. Wash your hands, stay away from sick people. Um, masks do work to help protect for the respiratory virus as they also help when you have allergies because that pollen doesn't get to your nose. Now, norovirus isn't the only respiratory virus they're seeing an uptick in. Coming up in an hour here, why doctors are seeing winter illnesses in warmer seasons and why many younger kids are also getting sick. Live in the newsroom, I'm Kara Dixon, 10 on your side.